So Paddle Fest is a recreation or a race, canoes and kayaks, starting at Savannah Rapids Pavilion and uh, ending here at the Riverkeeper office. It can either be a race, which will start a little bit earlier, um, and those folks will start all together um, and have their different categories to, to win in their race. Um, and then, but if you're not interested in trying to, you know, beat a time or to uh, beat your friends or your opponents, um, then a few minutes later, as soon as we get all the racers off, um, we'll start then with the recreational side of the uh, Paddle Fest and folks can just come down through, uh, enjoy an awesome day on the water. I was just steadily, you know, paddling. I've been doing it, you know, for like 35 years you know, up and down the river, but, you know, I'm just used to it. I paddle, I'm paddling the mountains lately, but I paddle in the oceans when I, you know, can, and I'm just, you know, used to, you know, paddling. Yeah, the first year I was in it, it started at I-20 in North Augusta at the Welcome Center. You went down a steep embankment, and I think the year after that, it, you know, they changed it to the, Larry says, the Redneck Riviera. You know, the, the, the clearing on the Georgia side below I-20, and they did it for many years there. They shot off like a loud gun, the homemade, the canoe, the rafts, kayaks all go off together, people would get stuck on the rocks, it was a lot of fun. And they did it for many years and then it ended and now it's back under you know, paddle pass with the river keepers. I was with a bunch of people, I was working at Fort Gordon at the time and we were in the publications, the field manager publications department, we had a, a lot of us. And as a group, we decided to build a raft and what, I, what we did, we found out the easiest way to build a raft was to go buy a semi-trailer truck tire sale place and they would sell us very cheaply the used inner tubes that they were no longer to use in trucks and I bought 24 of them over inflated them and then duct taped them all together we started up there at uh, about this time of morning at the uh, Redneck Riviera and we all put in and some of these rafts were not seaworthy they really were not of nautical architecture and we were able to, we, were, we didn't really get stuck, but every time we came to the rapids, one of these homemade rafts would disintegrate, literally. 